Blunt Cut Metalworks. Uh, this is June 15, 2016. And uh, more continuum from my previous video of this W266 Rockwell uh, Belay. And um, it got resharpened to about, I mean, I correct some of the edge from them and from previous tests, but it's not going to be perfect edge right now. But anyway, I'm going to do a quick rock well test for you to see. Uh, direct down here is 50, rock well, 60, 70. So it, this is 66 plus, it should be somewhere right here. It's right now, if you lower the angle of the camera down this way, it's at 66 and a half. All right, I'm going to put this play over here. I'm going to be swing the uh, camera around. I'm going to put my hand in front of the camera to block some of the view of my uh, awesome garage. And okay, so what you are seeing is uh, I think I have to pull back a little bit. Somehow they're recording Y aspect. Anyway, this one the edge currently. I mean, this is very drastic. The test, and so it's got from book paper, meaning that the edge fairly thin and sharp. But that's not really. I mean, the point of this is extreme test. So. What you see over here, this is my door. And it's not super full right now. The liquid nitrogen. So it's about minus 320 Fahrenheit or about 196 minus 196 Celsius. And uh, so to show you. I'm going to take this. It's not full, so I would, I'm looking for when the arc action a lot. That means when the blade hit the uh, liquid and it boil, it boiling out. I can hear the boiling now. You can see the uh, the arc action right now. And so if I bring it out. Well, I went this far and I bring it up right now and I see that part. And to show that actually fairly cold. There, you see the, the area that where it, it, it's uh, it in the, uh, the ice up right there. That, they got to that cold, but they're not total cold yet. When you submerge something like that, then it go complete, no more algae action. So right now it's cold, and I don't think it's, uh, I can hold it. It's probably not you know, super cold. So I'm going to try to reload it to that again. I can put into a freezer and get 
temperature, but I'm this thing is fairly low temperature right now. So I let it boil and it, it will be uh, cooling. I mean it will be below zero and it's quite cold. So when steel or metal, when you, you get below transition point, meaning that the material change, the toughness drop drastically. So in the cold, and now combined with this hardness, I mean failure is high. So if I would have to whittle this very tough bamboo, okay, I need glove on the other hand. But I will do a quick one. Okay, so the edge I not make it, but look like I mean, it didn't crumble. So I will now go to since I make it that far. I haven't got to uh, chopping would be the impact and see whether or not even this front right here survived the impact chopping this. So I'm going to do this do so while it, you can look at the door here until it stop boiling. When it came out, I will uh, widow the uh, bamboo first, and then perhaps I'll chop it and see what happens. I just pick it up some uh, marker I put on the floor here. Okay, so it's done. So that means the whole the blade because I got laid edge down anyway. So that means it it's minus uh, hundred and fifty. 95 Celsius. When I take it out, the temperature rises a little bit, but it's still the transition temperature for this steel is about zero, so this is minus way too cold here. <laughs> Alright, and I'm going to do a quick widow. Alright, and then I will do a quick chop. And see if it goes to shadow, just like in the, the uh, demonstration of liquid nitrogen. Okay, so I got to put it back to the loop door so it will really cool down. This time I'm going to freeze the bamboo as well. So the bamboo will become very hard. And uh, the bamboo would probably shadow, so now I got the edge is really brittle, supposed to be. You hit against something very hard. And brittle. So now you have recipe for disaster. So think of if uh, this is the uh, blade in for exploring deep space and you have really cold temperature. Well, we'll see if it survives. Okay, now done the action. The, the bamboo fiber, not that much, you know, in terms of heat capacity, so it uh, throws pretty easily and fast. Cold bamboo, cold blade, and I'm going to chop. Let's see how that does. My hand getting cold. <laughs> uh, let me clean it up real quick because all the frost, all the ice up really a lot. Let's see if the edge get damaged. 
Okay. So you don't see any, say, macro chip. And if this edge I sharpened it at to about 2000 grit water stone. So I am sure there is some minor, minor deformation or, you know, something. But overall survive cryo temperature. And chopping something also is frozen. It's it bamboo. Thanks for watching.